the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Come, O Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of the faithful, and kindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who has taught the hearts of the faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, grant us that by the gift of the same Spirit we may be always truly wise and ever rejoice in His consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Queen, conceive without sin. Pray for us. Praise the Lord, dear friends. Uh, look with me in uh, Proverbs chapter 4, verse 23. Keep your heart with all vigilance, for from it flows the spring of life. The Word of God is uh, instructing us as well as uh, reminding us uh, to um, guard our heart, guard our heart, because uh, you, we all need to guard our heart from all the distractions, from all the things of the world that would distract us and uh, uh, take us away from the Lord, uh, especially with regard to uh, sin and uh, evil deeds and uh, even the thoughts that as we entertain them, uh, it uh, grows in our heart and uh, we get carried away and uh, we fall in sin. So you need to guard your heart against um, against all uh, evil uh, things of the world uh, or against every evil that could happen to you. Only if you guard your heart, protect your heart and be vigilant, that's, that's the key, that you have to be alert and not be caught off guard when uh, things happen. Uh, it could be uh, a simple example would be uh, watching uh, watching anything on the computer screen or on, on TV where there are some things which are unholy, uh, which are not acceptable to God, but the popular media and all the media around the movies uh, that portray a woman as an object and uh, things are not good and holy. And however, we take it for granted that we can get away with it. However, in the heart, the seeds have been sown, seeds of lust, seeds of uh, impurity, um, could be seeds of uh, <coughs> other negative things. And if you are not careful and vigilant, then we would fall in sin. So let's give heed to the word of God that tells us to keep your heart uh, and uh, <coughs> protect your heart and be vigilant. May this word of God help you in your way of life that is pleasing to God. The Lord be with you, with your spirit. Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen.